Welcome to Teens and Fingers. In this lesson I'm learning to solve addition and subtraction problems that involve the teen numbers and using groups of five fingers. Let's start with this question. I've got 13 tennis balls. I lose two of them. I want to work out how many tennis balls do I have left. Well, to start with, I want to show 13 using my fingers. Now you can see I've only got 10 fingers, so I'm having to use a friend's hand as well. So down here, you can see I've got 10 fingers, and over here, I've got three more. So in total, I've got 13. Now the question says I need to take away two fingers. So that will involve folding down two fingers. Can you see how many fingers I'd have left? So I'd fold down this one, and I'd fold down this one here, which would leave me with one finger on this hand and ten more fingers over here. So in total, I'd have eleven fingers. Let's try another one. Uh, this time I've got nineteen people in my class at school. Unfortunately, five of them are sick. So I want to work out how many people do I have left in my class today. Well, I want to start by showing 19 using fingers. So you can see, see I've used my fingers and I've had to use somebody else's as well. So over here I've got 10 fingers, here I've got 5 fingers, and here I've got another 4. So in total I've got 19 fingers up here. Now the question says I need to take away 5 fingers. Can you see a quick way that I could take away five fingers? That's right, I could take away all of the fingers on this hand. So now the only fingers left up are these ten and these four. So you can see I've got fourteen fingers left. So nineteen minus five equals fourteen. Now let's try an addition question. Let's imagine there's a tree outside my window, and I look at it at night, and there are nine flowers on it. Now, when I wake up in the morning, I can see that there are five more flowers that have opened. I want to work out how many flowers are open on this plant now. So you can see down here that I've started by showing nine fingers that represent the nine flowers that were open. Now the question says that five more opened overnight. Can you think of a quick way that I could add in five more? Well you can see that a quick way to add in five more was to borrow a friend's hand. So now I've got these nine fingers plus these five fingers. So let's work out how many fingers do I have up in total. Well I can see that these fingers make ten and four more, so that's 14. 9 plus 5 equals 14. Let's try one more addition question. Let's imagine I've got 12 colouring pencils and my grandma gives me five more. I want to work out how many colouring pencils do I have in total. Well, down here you can see I'm representing the 12. I've got my hands, so there's 10 fingers here, and I've had to borrow somebody else's hand, or someone else is helping me out, and you can see they've got two fingers ex extended. So here we've got 12 fingers. Now the question says I need to add five more. Can you think of a quick way that we could do that? Well you can see I've asked my friend to use his other hand as well. So he's got five fingers here stretched out. So now I need to work out how many fingers have we got here in total. Well, I've got five, ten, plus another five equals fifteen. Plus these two, so I've got seventeen fingers. Well, I hope you've found this lesson helpful. For more help, check out Teacher Tools dot co dot nz